The hip is a ball and socket joint. The head of the femur, the thigh bone, forms the ball. The socket, also known as the acetabulum, is formed by the pelvic bones. The head of the femur and the acetabulum are capped with articular cartilage, which provides a smooth surface that prevents the bones from grinding against one another as the hip moves. Another, more fibrous type of cartilage, called the labrum, forms a rim around the acetabulum. This deepens the socket and contributes to the stability of the joint. Femoral acetabular impingement syndrome, or hip impingement, occurs when excess bone forms at the hip joint. When the extra bone occurs on the head and neck of the femur, it is known as cam impingement. When the extra bone occurs on the edge of the acetabulum, it is known as pincer impingement. Sometimes, both cam and pincer lesions are present. Whether the impingement is caused by a cam lesion, pincer lesion, or both, pain begins to occur in the groin and sometimes on the side of the hip along the joint line. Sharp pain may occur in positions that cause the impingement, such as with turning, twisting, or sitting. Over time, damage occurs to the articular cartilage and labrum. As the joint becomes arthritic, pain may become more constant and dull. The torn labrum may catch inside the joint, causing pain, popping, and catching.